I'm at the grocery store and I wanted to show you all the different water choices we had to choose from. We're bombarded by different beverages. And a lot of you have seen the Kangen water presentation and you think, yes, I must have alkaline water. Therefore, you run down to your local grocery store and you see these different ones out there. So one thing I want you to know is that alkaline water is different than alkalized water. Alkaline water, for instance, is this one right here. So this is alkaline water. And on the back, there's ingredients. The first ingredient here is, well, purified water, which is reverse osmosis water. Then sodium bicarbonate, which is baking soda added. And then they're also putting um, magnesium sulfate and calcium chloride. Those are alkaline buffers. So the difference between alkaline and alkalized is alkaline, they're adding things too because it's not stabilized. So they add the alkaline chemicals to the water to make it alkaline. Alkalized is simply electricity. And that is what our body wants. If you're putting in a lot of these inorganic minerals, they will build up in your body, can create calcium deposits, kidney stones, and can lead to glaucoma. So I wanted you guys to be aware of the different beverages out there and the difference between alkaline and alkalized. They're completely two different things. You'll never find Kangen water on the shelf because it doesn't last. So there's our different options. Definitely stay away from any alkaline waters on the shelf.